Searching for clues in a deadly shooting. A man has died after being found with multiple gunshot wounds at a neighborhood off Columbia Drive last night. DeKalb County Police are now working to get a better description of the suspect and a possible motive. Back at home, Delta chartered a flight to bring 42 Trinity Christian School students home from Puerto Rico. The students traveled to the U.S. territory for a mission trip days before two massive earthquakes hit the island. They're all safe, but back on the island, at least one person was killed, thousands still left without power. One of the first former educators in the Atlanta cheating scandal has been granted parole. Tamara Cotman served less than half of her three-year sentence. She is one of the 11 former teachers and administrators convicted of racketeering. The former educators were accused of changing students' answers on standardized tests and pocketing performance bonuses. Another Metro Atlanta company facing a fine accused of releasing cancer-causing gas into the air. Sterilization Services of Georgia is just off of Fulton Industrial Boulevard in Atlanta. It's being fined $3,000 a day this month until they install new filters to limit the emissions of ethylene oxide.